That distinctive stretch style of Kershaw. Ball hit through the middle. Marte around third. He's going to score. And the Diamondbacks, who had to come from behind in both games in Milwaukee, jump in front here at Dodger Stadium. His 14th pitch of this inning is driven to deep left. Back, way back, and off the wall. One run is home as Carroll sprints for the plate. And they'll have second and third with a 2-0 lead. High fly ball to deep left field. Forget about it. It's gone. A disastrous start for Clayton Kershaw. Moreno hit only seven during the regular season. Put a major charge into that one. And Longoria slams one toward the gap in left center field and out. And dives but can't get it. It will go to the wall. Thomas on his way to third and being waved home. It's a double for Longoria. The peg to the plate is late. And it's 6-0 Diamondbacks. And here's Perdomo. Look at this. Hayward back at the fence. Can't get it. Gone. He hit only six during the regular season. And he wasn't hitting at all in this postseason. But one swing changed all that. Cadell Marte, if it's fair, and it is, and this ball is way gone. Well, this is what you know about Lance Lynn. He gives up homers. You know, Marte in his first at bat, a long drive to left center field. And then boom, he hurts him right. every bit as much as Carroll could have. And here's another shot to deep left, down the line and gone! Three solo homers in the inning. This time it's Christian Walker. He might have to go to him earlier. There you go, baby. Right field, Hayward toward the line, near the foul pole. Fair ball, home run. Now Hayward. Maybe saying a replay is worth a look. Might be worth the challenge. In the bullpen, they're saying it was foul. Hayward is saying it was foul. Uh, they have a vested interest yes, in this they do. being foul. But you know what? The camera doesn't lie in this case, and it looks foul. The goal on the field is confirmed. Foul ball. 2-2 two -two count. So, Christian Walker has the home run erased, oh. and then hits the next pitch to the moon. There's your fourth home run. I've never seen anything like this. Nor have I. Forty-eight thousand plus. Every seat sold. Almost none of them in use right now. Everybody's standing. And the two-two pitch. Hit in the air to left. Goriel is there. The Arizona Diamondbacks sweep the Dodgers and head for the LCS. Dodgers swept in a playoff series for the first time since 2006. Fouled off a few to stay alive. Waits for another 2-2 and chases strike three. That's where teams have gone. Sixth in ERA, top ten in wins. He's home with a 1-2. And he strikes him out with a cutter to the knees. Out of the bottom of your lineup. Ooh, man. Nice strike three called. 
Kelly rocks and fires an 0-2. He throws another changeup, and it's a good one to get a swing and a miss. The Braves and the Twins facing off. It wound up being an all-timer. Strike three caught him. And they know when they can go. Seager chases a fastball for the Diamondbacks. His 1-2. Carter yeah. can't lay off, and Merrill Kelly strikes out the side in the sixth inning. Another 2-2 two -two is perfect to the outside corner, and the eighth strikeout from Merrill Kelly. And he got him looking, and Heim knew it. Nine strikeouts on the night for Merrill Kelly, who's got another 1-2-3 inning. Does not go. And now it is drilled deep to left field. Going back for show. Turning. Looking. See ya. A two-run home run for Lewis. And just like that, the Twins are up 2 nothing. Fly ball, right field and deep. Springer back, turning, looking. See ya! He's done it again! Back to back home runs for Lewis, and it's 3 0 Twins. There he goes. And there's a ground ball, diving stop by Solano, and he flips to Duran. They win. 18 is enough. The Twins get a postseason win, and they lead the wild card series one game to nothing. And Michael, to think a 5'8 first baseman with the dive, he needed every inch to make that play, and then the toss. Imperative for Fott and the Diamondbacks to post a zero Dirt. in this first inning. What a start. And the payoff. And he struck him out. Two and two to Real Muto. And a swing and a miss. He got him. For Brandon Fott. See what he does here. Two, two. And he rips that fastball. Oh, and two the count to Rojas. And he chased one. Down he goes. Still at second base with two outs. And Schwarber takes a called strike three. Base hit to win a World Series off Mariano Rivera in 01. Swing at a miss, and Fott picks up strikeout number seven. Fott and Suarez have been excellent. And a swing and a miss, and Fott keeps the pedal down. And a swing and a miss. And he pulls that one. It's past Bohm. Down into the corner it goes. Thomas is flying around third. The throw is cut off. And this game is tied. And the spinner is in there. A cold strike three. Kimbrell deals it all one. That's into center field. It's down. In the score is Smith. And the Diamondbacks walk off the Phillies in game. Cattell Marte puts his name in the books for the Diamondbacks. Their third postseason walk-off. Luis Gonzalez, Tony Womack, and Cattell Marte. The triple by Rojas, the number nine hitter. In the right center base hit. Perdomo with a single. A one out single here in the seventh inning. We'll get Marte to the plate with a man on. 
Soto deals 3-2 and Marte is aboard. First and third, two outs. Moreno takes ball four. Nine pitches, six of those breaking balls. And he deals a fast ball. He missed a bases loaded walk. The merry-go-round is on. It's a two-run game now. Walker, an RBI the easy way. Kimbrell fires and a swing and a drive down the left field line. That's going to get down. It goes to the wall on a couple of hops. Guriel into second base with a double. He deals. Thomas in the air to right field. That's back. Castellanos on the run. And we are tied. Alec Thomas takes the ride of his life. Two outs now. Here's Marte. And that's through for a base hit. And with two outs, the Diamondbacks have the go-ahead run aboard. Marte, great speed at first. Oh, and he hit him. Kimbrell drills him. In the air, left center. That's going to get down. Coming in to score, Marte. The Diamondbacks have the lead. Tying run at second. Two and two. Turner, a swing. He struck him out. Seawall closes the door. And the Arizona Diamondbacks, with back-to-back wins, have evened up this best-of-seven series at two apiece. And it was the kids who brought them home. Chance for more here. Bases loaded, one gone in the ninth. Stanix 1-1. One, one. He is thrilled on a line. Left field and gone! Adolis Garcia makes his statement. And the Rangers have their sights set on game seven. Well, I we on the train tracks, but it was special. Third straight game with a home run for Adolis Garcia. Two gone in the ninth. We're headed to a game seven in this all Texas championship series. And isn't it fitting that these teams that tied during the regular season at 90 and 72 still can't decide things through six games? Here's his payoff. Garcia gets up on it, drives it to left, back it goes. Off the wall. Carter read it well. Here he comes. Two to nothing, Texas in the first. Garcia starts the third and drives one the other way down the line. If it's fair, he's got another. He does. Adolis Garcia owning October.
His 2-0 is over the plate and grounded through the left side of base hit. Seeger's in. Here comes Carter. He'll score without a throw. Adolis Garcia is 3-for-3. Three three. Quite impressive. Tom, take it away. Here's the fly ball. Hold on one second. Back goes Brantley to the wall. And Adolis Garcia has hit another home run. Impossible. His fifth in the last four games. He owns Houston. second. Two years removed from losing 100. The Rangers have won the pennant. And they will play in the World Series for the first time since 2011. Their first real chance to make a new World Series memory after the heartbreak of that 2011 season and plenty of heartbreak along this path. Stays put and there's a high That home run trot. Look at the stare down of Orlando Arcia. So Arcia not paying attention, but yep, that was Arcia's quote. Add a boy Harper after Harper got doubled up to end game two. Harper, high fly ball, center field. He's watching. Harris turns. Harris leaps, and it's gone. Harper with a rainmaker and another stare down. Seven to one Phillies. And it's turned into the Bryce Harper game again. Brandon Fott deals. And he struck him out. Fott with a big K. Carroll up the middle and a base hit. Rivera round third. He will score the tying run. And Corbin Carroll, his third hit of the game. Carroll dancing at second. And Moreno into right field, a base hit. Here comes Carroll. Castellanos has a cannon. The throw is cut off. Carroll scores. Moreno in a rundown, a backhanded flip, and out at first. Ball pops it up. Thompson, two pitches, and he is going to get the Diamondbacks out of this inning. A leadoff double by Schwarber. That's exactly what he did yesterday, Saul Frank. Beats it into the ground. Perdomo slings it across the diamond. Two runs tonight. No catch. And a swing and a miss as Marsh strikes out. Moreno secures it at first. 0 oh, and to the count. Pache and Schwarber on the bags. Here he comes. Turner in the air to center field. Alec Thomas, routine for him. And both runners retreat. And Kinkle retires Trey Turner. Hitters count. Harper, a high fly ball to center field. Thomas settles under it. And Kevin Kinkle delivers two big outs for the Diamondbacks. The Phillies strand two. 
No catch. And he strikes out Bohm, who snaps his bat in frustration. 2-2 two, two to Bryson Stott. Yes. And he goes. A strikeout for Ginkle. Two outs in this eighth inning. And yes. did he go? He did. It is a strikeout. Ginkle strikes out the side in the eighth. Wow. Let it out, big fella. Strike away. Here he comes. Cave, a fly ball to right field over his Carroll. He's got it. And the Arizona Diamondbacks are headed to the World Series. The Diamondbacks have won the National League pennant. And the Fall Classic will return to the desert for the first time in 22 years. The comeback Diamondbacks, the answer backs. Ozzie Albies, first ball swinging. That is going to fall for a base hit. Acuna on his way to third. The first hit of the game for Atlanta. And now the throw gets away, and here comes Acuna. And a run is in. High in strikeouts. That ball's hit well. Darno, deep left. Goodbye. Two-run home run. It's a one-run game. Here he comes. Riley in the air to left field. On the run, Marsh. There it goes. Austin Riley has given the Braves the lead in the eighth. He deals a 2-2. Castellanos in the air to right center field. Harris is on the run. Harris at the track. He leaps and he makes the catch. Harper might be doubled up. The throw gets away. The throw to first. It's over. It's over. Harper never tagged. He couldn't get back. And it's a double up to end game two. Wow. What a catch by Michael Harris the second and the wheels were in motion he shocked Harper that he caught that ball it was Austin Riley who was backing up the throw that initially got away Frenchy and the man who hit the homer to give the Braves the lead gets the final out shot here not something he intended to do but he will take it he sure will take it first hit of the day for the Texas Rangers 21 year old rookie Evan Carter pulls one into right center field and it's back to back hits cut off by Carroll Seager to third Carter to second he's in with a double the dam breaks here in the seventh on an 01. Grounds one through. Texas takes the lead. Seager's in to score. Carter stopped at third. And after six innings without a hit, three in a row here on the seventh. We'll have the offense show up. And this is going to be the clincher. Hot shot in the center field. Three consecutive hits in the ninth. The ball gets by. It's all the way to the track. It goes all the way to the wall and two runs score. Heim to third, it's three to nothing, Texas. Out of it, third, two out. Here's an 0-1 to Simeon. In the air to left center field. Guriel's back. It is gone! Texas on the verge! It's
it's a four spot. It would be a fitting final touch to this run for the Rangers. Well, they've collectively, they've gone up off the mat, every punch, every scenario. They've been relentless. It's happened! The Texas Rangers win the World Series! Dolis Garcia drives about the air, deep left center field. McCormick to the track, at the wall, it is gone! And here comes the man of the day to this point, Adonis Garcia. And he gets the first pitch here and gets right in Maldonado's ear. The benches are clearing in the American League Championship Series. Everybody doing their very best to keep their cool, but Garcia's losing his. But right in Maldonado, bullpen is empty. But more important than ever right now that everybody keeps their cool, understanding the bigger picture of this series and this season. Well, you can understand why he's so hot. That's a 97 mile an hour fastball up near the shoulder. And a lot of it might have to do with how long he walked after he hit that home run. But you can understand why he's heated. That was not what I was trying to do. Trying to bury a fastball in, yes, and the ball just rides up. And I know the circumstances smell a little differently. <laughs> and I think they just threw out a break. So the umpires don't convince. But that one just got away from Brian Abreu, who only hit three batters all regular season. And Dusty will end up going, too. And he loves Brian Abreu. And Dusty has a case. I mean, this is a tough call for the umpires. The 0-1.
Altuve with a ninth That's inning good. home run to put the Astros in front. And then Ryan Presley sneaks his way out of the bottom of the ninth. We're at the top of the order looming. Tavares takes ball four. Could tie it with one swing. High drive! It's tied! Adolis Garcia sends one the other way. That sends Carroll back. He's at the wall, and the legend grows! Adolis Garcia wins game one!